Welcome to JSA TV, the newsroom for tech and telecom professionals. I'm Jamie Scott Okataya of JSA. Joining me here at ITW 2018 in the fabulous Chicago, my dear friend, Mr. Cliff Keynes. He's the co-CEO of Clarion. Cliff, welcome to JSA TV. Thanks for having me, Jamie. Love to be here. Uh, it's always a pleasure. And for sure, Clarion is not the same company Six months ago, three years ago, it's just uh, uh, unbelievable uh, on a ride, on a roller coaster ride. Uh, so tell our viewers who might not already know. So uh, yeah, we started off as a dark fiber provider, but you know the, the plan was always really to uh, to address the uh, uh, the five G coming wave of five G intensification and access and how access is changing. So what we've been doing is acquiring uh, assets that put us in position to uh, to really uh, benefit from those opportunities. So it's, it's been a, a wild ride, you're right. We've done five acquisitions uh, in, since June of 2015, and we'll be doing more. So absolutely on an acquisition tier, and just uh, here at ITW, you dropped some news that have dropped some jaws. So why don't you tell us a little bit more about that? Yeah, so we, uh, we announced the uh, NYNJ-1, uh, which is a subsea link connecting uh, the uh, Long Island uh, 1025 Connect data center with the data centers in Wall Township. Uh, it's a, a unique route. No one has anything quite like it. Um, and it's uh, in the water. Uh, it'll be operational soon. We're taking orders. <laughs> so uh, just uh, let me know if, uh, if you need any further information about that. I'm happy to, uh, to uh, provide other details. I mean, just, uh, just taking a beat here, because that's pretty unbelievable, a subsea link. Uh, between Long Island and Wall, New Jersey, that is in the water, and you are now taking orders. Yes, I mean, that's yeah. that's a first. Yes, it's it's absolutely a first. I think uh, the market will see a lot more of these uh, around the world because it just pays to have these uh, redundant and uh, diverse routes connecting the uh, the landing stations uh, on both coasts and and throughout Europe. So I think we're, we're going to see uh, a market of, uh, of, of, of new uh, uh, you know, uh, bypass-type cables around the world. And you know, we're, we're fortunate here to, uh, to be able to pull this one off as a first on the East Coast. That's um, unbelievable. And, and, and literally, um, I kid you not, it's, it's a palpable buzz here at ITW over this news. And um, putting, putting your company growth, your subsea builds, your acquisitions aside, Tell us, why is Clarion's message resonating so well right now? Uh, that's, you know, that's a great question. I, I, I think what we're, we're trying to do here is, is finally reaching the market uh, through the real estate community, through uh, the access uh, carrier community, uh, through the uh, data center community, uh, because at the end of the day, uh, all these assets have to work uh, in harmony with each other. And you know we are taking the position that if we uh, own these assets and control them, we can deliver a high quality, higher quality of service to our customers and provide uh, more of a turnkey uh, solutions to our customers. Yeah, for sure. And so I love to ask this question, particularly from my uh, my CEOs that I get to sit in the hot seat next to me. Um, looking in your crystal ball, mm -hmm. you know, the one you have right, right in your back yeah, pocket. I have one. <laughs> Where do you see Clarion going in the next six to twelve months ahead? Uh, that's a that's a short window, so it's probably pretty easy to answer. Uh, but we'll absolutely do at least one more acquisition in that time frame, maybe two, uh, and we'll probably wind up expanding into uh, other geographies. So uh, we're you know focusing on delivering these access access solutions by, by combining our fiber uh, data center assets. Uh, we may be uh, looking at uh, some real estate assets uh, that would help, su such as uh, you know, uh, rooftop or building access rights and that type of thing, uh, to provide uh, uh, more turnkey solutions for the wireless community and, and, and densification and, and 5G. Uh, but at the end of the day, we, uh, you know, it's, it's, we're really all about access and providing access to, uh, in a bi-directional way, uh, for customers to access any carrier they want and for the carriers to be able to reach the customers without paying undue uh, you know, uh, tolls on, on, on reaching them, so. Well, there you go, wireless guys, watch out. Clarion is on the move. And thank you so much, Cliff, for being so generous with your time once again here on JSA TV. Always great to see you, Jamie. Thanks for having me over. Uh, and thank you viewers for tuning in to JSA TV. Happy networking.